In this video we're going to be learning how to apply patch in Drupal Composer project. We're going to learn when do we need patches, where to find the patches and how to apply patches in our Composer JSON file. There will be a full example in this video on how to do it. So here we have a Drupal instance installed and let's say we need our editor to be able to edit just specific menu. Here we have many menus, but we want to make it possible for them just to edit the footer and the main navigation. And if we check people permissions, if we search for menu, we see that out of the box in Drupal core, it's possible to give the permission just to edit all the menus and not just specific menus. But of course there is a module and this module is called menu admin per menu and we're going to download and install it and we're going to see how it works. Perfect, and now we're going to menu, admin per menu. So we have the menu admin per menu module activated. And now essentially, when we go to people and permissions, and if we search for menu, now we see there permissions for each of the menus and in our case for our editors we're going to activate just the footer and the main menu which actually makes sense we don't want them to be able to edit also the main navigation from the toolbar and stuff like that and if we then go to structure and menus and if we edit the menu, we see that here, basically, there is something missing. So there is the overall menu title that is missing. And that's kind of a bug from the menu admin per menu module. And if we search in its issue queue, if we search for something like that. So we are on the drupal.org page of the module. And then when we go to issues and if we search for something, in this case, I will just search for the path here and I will just say any issue. And if I search, I don't find anything but if I say mm, module makes title or something similar, essentially you pretty much search and then at some point, maybe you find an issue, like in this case, module makes the title on admin structure menu disappear. And yeah, the good thing here is that someone also complained about the same problem. So I don't understand enough, blah, 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 but he says that actually the title here is disappearing and there is already a patch for that, that someone contributed. So how to apply this patch? If we open the GitHub page of the Drupal Drupal Composer project. There is the GitHub page in the front and in the readme it's clearly stated that the patches could be applied in the extra 
array item and the composer JSON file. So if we open our editor and if we go to the composer JSON file, we see that already here there is extra, but there are no patches. So we're going to simply create it. So we see there is patches and there is already an example there. So I'll explain to you a bit the structure and we could just put it here and we're going to have to close it of course and put comma there and the next idea is that here you put essentially the the name of the module so as we just installed the module and as we did a composer require here we see that there is the module so we just put the name and the namespace of the module first and then as we see here from the example we create a subarray like so and here first we have the explanation of the problem so usually it's always a good idea to just use the title of the issue that's what I do so here the title of the issue and then you just put actually the path to the patch file so we just copy here the link address so if we just paste it here there we go we have it as it should be and now we could simply jump back to the terminal and we could say we are actually in the folder with the composer json file we could again say composer install and hit enter and as you see here it actually applied the patch which is exactly what we want to do and here it also says what is the patch so yeah essentially let's go ahead and have a look now if we jump back to our Drupal instance and if we clear the cache so let's clear the cache just in case and if we go back to structure and menus and we see that here menus now appears that's because the patch is there it's applying and it's actually fixing the bug that we experienced in our contributed module so that's pretty much it if you like this video please check the links in the description like subscribe and thanks for watching